we will add a J, J, uh, J database file. So we go back here again. And this JDatabase file is saved in our local, uh, look, like in our local machine. So in order to get it, you cannot find if you go all the way up or you check here for the drop down here, you cannot see how to add data. So you need to go folder connections and create a new connect to folder. So you connect to your local folder and you can navigate through here or you can simply type your location here, your path. And then OK. Now, if we go back up again, we we'll open folder location, we can see the data we have right here. We're going to go to, <clears throat> excuse me, we will go to USA. And then we're going to look for a geodatabase. See how it ends dot GDP. When you see that, you know it's a geodatabase. We will go to cities and we will add the cities layer. Now we have all the cities of the uh, the cities of the US is shown on the map. We're gonna go again and add the add the states now. Here's the states of the US, and let's see how we can get. It's gonna be probably in trans. Here we go. Highways, highways. So now we add the highways uh, and the cities and the states of the US. At the end of this video, I want to thank you so much for having the time to watch the video. If you are interested to learn more about ArcGIS products, please go to arcgismastery.com and you will see that we have a lot of selection for online training courses, starting by ArcGIS Desktop and another products like ArcGIS Online, ArcGIS Pro, ArcGIS Enterprise, and so many more. We also have coming courses that you can subscribe to and enroll right now and get a 50% discount. And we will appreciate it if you leave a comment below and let us know what exactly you need to see in this course so we include it in the course for you. And lastly, I will encourage you so much to subscribe to our monthly updates so you can stay updated with what Esri do. At the end, I wish you all the best and thank you so much for watching this video.